I'm here in downtown LA Art Walk Lounge with Yuri Elvin, who's doing a live art show right now. What's your favorite aspect of live art? I'm always doing this, so it becomes like a, a bubble. No matter what's happening around you, you're always doing stuff. And, and, um, and whether there's people around or not, once it starts, it starts leading you, and once you start trailing, it's like a high pitch frequency. You can't actually uh, see what else is going on. Does that answer the question? Kind of. It does. So it's in a way like you're in your zone. I made a few drawings a few days ago, and then it was kind of a theme off that. But I I, I drew this on here in ballpoint, and then when it's unpolished, it actually looks great, and it changes. Art changes with what happens in the world. So does the energy of the crowd affect your artwork at all? Oh sure, I love people. And um, you have people who appreciate it at the same time you have people who get really offended by what's happening. And that's okay with me. So how long does it usually take you to complete one of these pieces? Uh, I drew this last night, I'll paint it today. Probably a few hours. That one, about 26 minutes, and the other ones probably a few of them were a series of two, three weeks at the same time, all laid out on the on the concrete at the place. And so uh, sometimes it can take forever, and then sometimes you'll work on something for, for a few weeks, and as well as other things for like 60, 70 hours a week, and then you'll just paint over them. So this is a larger piece that was cut down from a, from a six foot by nine foot. This was six by nine and chopped like 40 inches off the side yesterday, stretched it on this guy. And, 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 and if if I if nothing happens with it within the next year, I get bored, I might just need a piece and I'll just paint over it. So out of these artwork, you know, these pieces that you have here, do you have a favorite? Uh, I like the octopus and the crab fighting over a bottle of sake. And it's nautical sake because it has an anchor on it. It tells the whole story. This is a question that you know you probably get a lot when it comes to canvas. Does size matter? The larger the, 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 paint, the, the canvas, I think it's easier to paint and express yourself. But then I, paint, I draw every day on very small paper and larger paper. But I, I draw every day on, on small pads. And I, can, I really enjoy drawing. I enjoy drawing much more than painting. And the larger you paint, the more you can move around. If you try to paint really small, I find it's, it's restrictive. Um, and um, it, it, takes, it takes a lot of talent to paint something nice very small. Do you have any social media or website? YuriElvin.com. Uh, my Facebook is just packed with drawings. Like Usually this kind of stuff with black and white and ballpoint.